number eight, free space options. The free space is a tube's empty value not occupied by the sample. It is important to know this value so when a known volume of gas is dosed, the volume of gas occupying the void space above the sample can be subtracted to accurately calculate the quantity absorbed by the sample. There are three different free space options available for all micromoritics instruments. The first one is measure. It measures the free space with helium before the analysis and it gives the most accurate BT result. Helium is used to measure the free space due to its lack of interaction with most samples. However, there are some exceptions. For microporous samples, helium is known to get trapped in their small pores that the result often gets compromised from helium desorption at low pressures when the free space is measured before analysis. Entering and calculating free space can help the helium entrapment issue. Entering the free space skips the free space measurement, so the sample is exposed to the assortive gas before being exposed to helium. The enter free space values should be close to the measure values since this information is used for determining the dose amount. After the analysis, free space should be measured and the correct measure values should be entered into the data. Another way to avoid helium exposure on a sample is calculating free space with a calibrated blank tube and density of the sample. It also helps to save helium significantly since the free space is not being measured in every analysis. For step-by-step -step instructions on this method, please refer to How to Minimize Helium Usage on Disorption Instruments video. The 3 Flex is primarily designed for micropore analysis, and it has an additional option to measure the free space after analysis. If there is a suspicion that the sample is interacting with helium on a measure free space analysis, it is best to double check with the following method. First, re-degas the sample, and then perform the analysis again on the same sample tube with enter free space where the previously measured free space values are entered. If there is a significant difference between the two, then the sample may have been interacting with helium, and the free space option should be properly modified.